Hey guys, no live show today, but the game was so much fun. I wanted to come on and talk about it. Aaron Judge got things started with his 21st home run of the year, leading off the game. Opposite field smash. He is on pace to break Roger Maris's single season American League record. Luis Severino was in prime form today, had the slider really working. Fastball was good. He was around the zone. He gave up just one hit, and it really could have been scored an error. It was a line drive by Miguel Cabrera that hit IKF in the glove. Got ruled a hit, but in retrospect, probably could have been an error. That's all that stood between the Yankees and a no-hitter today. Severino was just pounding the zone. The Tigers really had no chance. They have the worst offense in the American League. Anthony Rizzo's offense has been looking much better lately. He goes second deck, his second home run in as many games. This one a blast, 13th of the year. Severino goes seven. Yankees win this one three to nothing. They are 38 and 15. That is the best record in Major League Baseball. Severino gets the belt. He is four and one on the season with 10 strikeouts. Also, you note there in the sidebar, Miguel Andujar has requested a trade. He has been sent down to AAA. He was playing well, in my opinion, not hitting for much power, but, you know, making contact looked fine in the outfield to me. He apparently is tired of the Scranton shuffle, feels like he deserves a chance to be an everyday player in the major leagues. And I can't say that he's wrong. I think he's done a fine job and he would probably hit better if he got continuous playing time in the major leagues. I think he's earned it. I think the Yankees should have made him the everyday left fielder and done something else with Joey Gallo. He struck out three more times today. It's getting to the point where I can't even watch his at bat. So I hope everything works out for Miguel Andujar. He's a promising player. I wish him the best.